In this video, we're going to look at some of the indice rules, and I've written them up here. We've got the one where you multiply together, when you divide, when you're in brackets, and that anything to the power of zero is one. So let's just have a go at these questions. So the first one says 2a cubed times 5a to the 7. So the best way to do this is separate out the big numbers, so the 2 and the 5, and then the letter terms, put them together. So 2 times 5, well, that's 10. And when we're multiplying um, terms with indices together, we just add their powers together. So this is going to be a to the power of 3 plus 7. So this is going to be 10a to the 10. Right, let's look at the second one. So let's deal with what's in the bracket first. So um, multiplying uh, letter terms together, so we're going to add the powers so that's going to be 7 plus negative 2 is 5. So we'll divide it. And when we are dividing, then we take away the powers. So it's going to be b equals 5 minus 1.5. And b to the power of 3.5 is our answer. Okay, let's move on to the last two here. Uh, next one, well, we have got some bracket action involved. So bracket says if you have a power inside and outside the bracket, you times them together. So what I've got here is I've got 4 to the power of 1 times c to the power of negative 3 all squared. So I'm going to multiply both those powers by 2. So we're going to get 4 to the power of 1 times 2 times by c to the power of negative 3 times 2. So 4 times uh, 4 to the power of 1 times 2 is 4 squared, times uh, negative 3 times 2 is negative 6, and 4 squared, we know what that is, that's 16, so it's 16c to the negative 6. Okay. Last one here, again, let's split, split out the big numbers, so we've got 5 times 2, and then we've got times by d to the 3.3 times d to the negative 3.3, so times our powers together, 10, and we've got d, so we've got add our powers because we're multiplying the terms together. Uh, so we're going to have 10d. Now, 3.3 plus negative 3.3 is 0. And we know from up here that anything to the power of 0 is 1. So 10d to the 0 is the same as saying 10 times 1. So the answer is 10. 